everybody. Who is ready for some Thanksgiving nails? <clears throat> I couldn't sleep, so I'm doing this for you guys actually before Thanksgiving, and I did not plan on that, but hey, my lack of sleep brings you another video. <laughs> um, obviously, it started out already, but um, I have tips on again. These ones were already pink. I didn't paint these ones. Um, put them on with the solid nail glue. Um, and then I have my Orly Bonder on top of the nails because it helps the strips stick to them better. Um, we're using, I have Turkey Trot out. Um, on my thumbs is just a random strip that I had left from Halloween. Um, I think this is Fami Familia is Everything from the Spanish Heritage Collection last year. Um, yeah, and then I started putting Turkey Trot on. I've got that going on my pointer and my ring fing a pinky finger. So, all right, we're going to keep going. Um, so next thing I'm going to do is my middle finger. I'm going to put both of these Turkey Trot strips that I have left on that finger because I know neither one of them is going to make it completely covering that nail because it's too wide, especially with a tip on it. So um, I'm just going to kind of do like put this to one side and then put the little, little turkey guy over top of it on the other side so then we'll have like a little peek of stripes. Actually you'll see the stripes through um, the turkey strip but because this, this set is super sheer. I don't know if you could see that when I first pulled this strip off but um, can you see how it's it's like very sheer. So we will see the stripes peeking out under the turkey or yeah under the turkey <laughs> I think about it for a second uh, my strips just go on so much easier so much nicer <laughs> on tips than they do on my natural nails at least at the moment especially because these are all nice and smooth instead of having any ridges or bumps like my nails do. I mean, I use ridge filler, but it can only do so much. So the areas of my nails that are really damaged, I um, can't usually fill that. <laughs> it's just gonna, it's there, you know? So these, it's like this perfect smooth application That got really quiet. I don't know if you can even really hear it. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Get off of me. Thank you. I hate those little plastic things. Always want to stick to me and not anything else. Even with my little rubbery trash can that should attract it more than my finger. It still wants to try and stick. All right, so see, you can see this one too, like lots of sheer because you don't even have the stripes on this one that are um, a little darker. So it's super, super sheer, the turkey strip is. Um, so we will see if it makes something cute or a hot mess. Putting it down over the stripes, I think it's going to be cute. <sighs> I want to like start from this side here so I make sure I get it covered. And I also don't want to lose any turkey. Ah, nope, it's down now. All right. I don't want to lose no turkey. Oh, 
I mean, yeah, you can definitely see the stripes through it. Just not quite as much as I probably would like it to be so that it looks a little more intentional, but I think it's fine. All right, let's do the other one. I'm not sure if you can tell what I have planned for my ring finger, but with all these twosies laying out here, um, we are going to do a braid on our ring finger as an accent. All right. Trim this one, and then I'm also going to put um, hold on, sorry. Um, I'm going to put a strip of the leave overlay there um, on the thumbs. <laughs> Get off of me, thank you. Needs a little, a little smushing, a little smushing. Like when I'm holding it up like this to look at it, it doesn't look great. But when I put it down and look at it, just like from the top, I don't know. I like it. I think it looks good. Okay. One little piece on the corner, I gotta... Sometimes I need to turn my hand in a way I can't while I'm on camera. There we go. All right, so let's do thumbs real quick. I'm not 100% sure which one I wanna use. If I want to use the one with a whole bunch of leaves or just the few. I think just the few is the best. Um, let's see how it looks. We're going to lose some of it, I think, because this is a... Like more of a deeper orange color. I don't know, we might lose some of the leaf, but I think we'll still see quite a bit of it. Because it's got a lot of red in there too. Red and like purple, so... I think we'll still, God, that's good. I'm, yeah, sorry. All right, let's see if it's still as good over this. Oh yeah, that's not too bad. You can see it pretty well. That's cute. Yeah, just a little, a little touch of something, not anything too much. Um, yeah, I think that's the best way. Because we're going to be having a lot going on with the braid. So I'm going to keep everything else pretty simple. Even with my tips on, I still, they're not quite long enough to make me need a, sec a second strip, which is good. I kind of intentionally, I was keeping them cut short because I hate having to use two thumb strips. So, and this length is just right that I don't have to. need to turn on my I completely moved my nail desk um like turned it around facing a different way and I don't know where <laughs> I don't know where I put my 
nail thing because it was, uh, there it is. I knew I put it in one of the drawers, but I wasn't sure which one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, I use this little hair straightener. It's getting pretty, getting pretty beat up at this point, but yeah, I use this to close my packages up. So we will put, I think I just called this the leaf strip. I didn't even call it by the right name. Um, we'll put happy, happy harvest back in here. Um, I'm not going to seal it right away because I might... I don't know, I was thinking maybe on this striped one, doing some leaves too. But I'm not, oh, we could do just the one, like that, oh, that would be cute, okay. That's cute, I like that, okay. As I have, I haven't even put it down yet. And I'm like, yeah, 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 that's cute. But it is, look at that. So cute. Yeah, I like that. That's cute. All right. Now I might go a little farther. <clears throat> I can't just leave it alone, can I? Um, hold on, let's put this one down first and then I'll... Okay. I think that looks super cute over the stripes. All right. can't help it. All right, let's do this. Let's see here. I'm going to take this one and we are going to fold this little baby in half. And cut it. And then we are going to do this. Did I take it too far? You'll have to tell me. But at this point, it's done. <laughs> I love, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> Choking on air over here. Um. saying now oh I love that this has a little bit of sparkle in it it's not too much it's just a just a little hint of it and I like it it's very cute although you know I'm probably gonna put some sparkle sauce on this anyways because <laughs> it's just a little bit of glitter it's not the heather amount of glitter, so. But it is cute that it has a little bit of something on it, you know? I almost wanna try this, um, just bare nails, see what it looks like. 
Um, I bet you it would be super, super cute. No, don't lay down yet. This is why I end up doing it backwards because I always am afraid it's gonna stick before I'm ready. All right, let's do it this way again. It's actually got like gold and orange and even a little green. It's got like the, cause it's the, um, it's the hollow glitter. So it like changes with the light. I like that. Yep, that's good stuff. Okay, get these little corners off. Okay, now am I done? Of course not. Of course not. You guys think I was done? <laughs> My hand is going numb. I have to let it like dangle for a minute. Okay. Let's see how this looks. So just like on the thumb, we should probably end up with two leaves on this. Meh. There we go. Okay. We're going to start with this one because I want this bottom leaf over where the stripies are. I feel like I lost too much of the leaf there and I don't like that. I wonder, can I do like... Mm. No, let's leave it alone, Heather. Just hate wasting them. Oh. Red monkeys, can we get it? Nope, there's like no way for me to. I don't want it on this side. Don't want it over the turkey. Trying to decide. Yeah, let's just do it. Let's just do it. We're going to cut this. <laughs> it's going to be kind of patched together, but it's okay. We'll put some plumping top coat and it will be fine. It'll be fine. No big deal. There we go. You knew I was going to do it, didn't you? I just like the little peak of it at the top. It looks cute. All right. 
Now we're gonna put this one away because I will not go so far as to do a braid that's super pattern, you know, and then put the leaves on top of my braid. I won't do it. So we'll, we'll, we'll stop with the leaves right here. We'll be good. Okay. I think that's good though, that I put them on there. I think I like it. All right. Let's put these away so they don't get stale on us. Okay, I kind of want to use the pinky strips to add more. I think I might. <laughs> I can't stop it. I can't help it. I'm a nail addict and an overlay addict. Should we start a support group? Hi, my name is Heather. <laughs> I'm a nail and overlay addict. And I'm not gonna stop. <laughs> Get in there. Get in there. wonder do I need more than one of the small pinkies to add some leaves I don't think I do because there's so many on that one we'll just leave out one we'll leave out one of the baby pinkies and put the other one back in here that way I can I'm limiting the crazy <laughs> It's going to be a long one. We'll call it the Thanksgiving special. Okay. Got those little guys sealed up good. All right. Let's do this real quick. Real quick. Quick, quick, quick. I promise. Sort of. Get stupid plastic. How, sorry, I need a sip of water. Um, how many of you have those stupid little plastic strips all over your house? Yeah. Because they stick to crap and then you just like, you can't, you can't get them off and then they go flying at some point and you're walking around and you see the little bit of purple on your floor and you're like, oh, curse you. <laughs> Come off. Oh, there we go. All right. Let's put you right here. I don't know what is going on with my hand tonight. It's like extra numb, way more than usual. It's driving me crazy. Okay. I was doing a lot, a lot, a lot of computer stuff though today at work, like extra, extra stuff. More, I mean, I always do a lot of computer work, but it was just a bit more of it today. So, you know, that doesn't help sitting there on the mouse. Okay. Ma, don't run away. Don't run away, my little leafy friend. I know. I sound crazy talking to leaves, but that's why you guys are here. Because <laughs> you must love my crazy to 
to come back. Hold on. I guess I probably should have just put the thumb strip that had more leaves on it, but <sighs> I didn't, so let's see. Can I get this one? I'm like a glutton for punishment here. I'm just adding more and more. I think it was worth it though, because it looks cute. Yeah. All right, now we need to figure out which one do I want to put on here. Let's see. Let's just do this. How much of this is going to come off on the tab? Not a little bit. can't even see that because it's all the orange bits of the leaf that came off no red let's do this then don't stick to my finger please I've got like a Franken nail thing going on here because I'm like piecing together. I know it looks a little crazy right now, but once I put some top coat on it, it'll be fine. All right, let's go ahead and start our braid. Um, I have not decided 100% yet if I'm gonna put the green in. I kind of want to, but I don't want to have four colors at the same time. Um, so I'm not, I'm not 100% sure yet if I'm going to put that in. Sorry, I'm looking for my line punch. Nope, that's a dragonfly. That one's not well prepared here tonight, huh? Where is it? Hmm. That's weird. Nope. I got my circle punch out on the desk. Get these out of the way. Is it behind? Ah. Right behind me. All right. And you don't need this, but I like it because I like to make, I'm not good at cutting straight lines. You know, we all have our, we all have our strengths and that is not one of mine. So, um, Trying to decide. I think we'll use this one as our 
base strip. So I'm going to build off the nail. Um, I'm not going to, and then I'll put the nail strip down after the braid is built. After it is constructed, we shall put down the strip on our nail. All right. So we're going to put this here. All right, and let's get one of each of these out. I don't think I'm going to need two of these, but I just had them out just in case. But usually... I think two strips should make enough pieces that I only need one set of twosies for these colors. I may need another of, so I have, sorry, I didn't tell you what I was using. This is at the Plaza, coming in hot, Crantastic, and then we may throw in a little She's a Trooper. Let's see. I have to kind of just look at the colors for a little bit and think about it. <laughs> All right, so let's take this off. And then I just use my line punch to make like straight lines here. So, and I try to just use the big one and not the little one because the little ones are not usually enough to make a all the way across kind of thing going on. Okay. red lines. Don't want that. Alright, so we got, you know what, I'm going to punch both strips, I think. Okay. Probably should have done this before starting, but then... They would have been sitting out the whole time that I was putting the other stuff on my nails and I don't know, they might have started to dry, especially considering that I'm cutting out such little pieces, you know? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Well, that's all right. We have one little, oh, no, don't you go back inside. Come out and play. Okay, and we can get probably two more lines out of this strip. Let's see. Maybe one. Maybe one. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, no, we got two. Okay, because we can just go like this. And there we go. my hand driving me crazy okay all right now let's do some orange ones Let me get a little bit of red. 
I'm just stuck in there. There we go. I love coming in hot. It is super pretty. Let's see, I could use this one. The other ones are not really even. Okay. So for those of you, I know some people said that they do watch it um, when I've talked about it on the channel before, but if you like ASMR videos, I'm going to be, I edited the first video for my new channel, but I haven't, I want um, to show it to a couple people before I post it. So, um, but I'm going to start my ASMR channel, um, just in the interest of like, so I have time for all of it. Probably only going to do one video a week there. Um, cause those videos take quite a bit longer to, to do and to edit and all that stuff. So, um, I actually have three videos recorded right now, but, um, the first, the other two that I did, I watched them and I feel like they need um, a bit more editing than I had to do with the first one that I'm going to post. So um, I'm hoping before the beginning of December, I will post my first video there on that channel. Um, channel name is going is a... Uh, ASMR Gypsy. I'm going back and forth between two names, that or ASMR Fairy, but I haven't decided 100%, but I think we're going with Gypsy. So, um, once I actually post something to the channel, I'll let you guys know if you want to go and check it out. Um... Trying to decide if I should use a clear strip to build on or if I want to use a, one of the colors. I feel like I want to use one of the colors. I like because then that fills in the little bottom bit when you have one of the colored strips as your um, base. piece right there. Yep. Okay. You used a lot, most of that strip. <laughs> All right, let's start with this and see how it looks and then we'll decide on. Okay. I might put this on a post-it just so I have a little more to hold it with. Okay. So we'll start, let's start with a red. So if you've not done a braid before, you kind of take these strips and place them across and um, layer them. All right, so I'm actually gonna turn this a little sideways, I think. All right, and we're gonna go way down to the bottom here, as close as I can get anyways. 
And we're gonna put this across at an angle. save this little guy because I might use it. All right, and now let's do orange. So we're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna take it off. We're gonna put it across, but we're gonna put it the opposite direction now. So we're gonna go like this. Okay, I did not think about this part that these are a little sheer. So it's gonna affect how well you can see the color because it's on top of the brown. Maybe I do need to get out a clear strip to build on before I get too far into this. What do I want to do? No, I think it's fine. Okay, it's fine. So we do kind of like crisscross, then we're gonna take the next color I've used at the plaza before so I'm not sure if this is sheer or not honestly but it shouldn't matter because we're putting it down on the same strip so um so now with this one what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and put it down so that it runs at the same angle as Crantastic so this should run right along next to it. <laughs> you can't see it at all. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's, let's keep trying. Hold on. Let's see once I put another strip it fantastic down how it looks so then we go back start at the first color again oh i've got to decide now if i want green in there or not um if i want to do four colors instead of three obviously traditional braid is going to be three colors but I don't think that this is going to work. I think I need a strip of clear to build this on. Although, I mean, it's not changing the color of this. It's just... some white. Do I have a white strip I can put it on? Because then that will just bring out the colors in it more. I'm just digging through my partials here. I could do this. This is a Swiss and Health thumbs or not thumb strip um pedicure strips so they're white 
Let's see. It'll be, I'll have to take one of the bigger ones to make sure it's big enough to go across this in both fingers. Or we can just do two. So that way it's, yeah, let's do that. Let's try this again. All right, so we're gonna start and start with the red again. I think I always do them at too shallow of an angle too. So I'm gonna try doing it at a little more of an angle. I feel like my braids end up looking kind of flat and I think that might be what it is is that I end up putting it no I want this part here we want okay I end up putting it at such an angle that it's like it's just very almost straight across instead of like truly at an angle I'm not even going to worry about saving these bits. They're twosies. I will open more. Okay. I almost want to double this. But then it'll be extra thick because you're going to have, it's going to be thick already because you've got all these um, strips going on there. Okay, that might be too deep of an angle now, we'll see. <laughs> This is also why you come here though, right? Because I show you my mistakes. Or when I have a hard time with things, I don't. I just let you see it, you know? All right, so now we will do this one. And you are gonna run it right along next to Grandtastic. <sighs> Dang it. Where did it go? I had a little piece stuck to my finger. straighten it out and fix that one little spot. Let's see. Maybe, maybe not. green in here. Do we want to do a four strand braid? I don't know. Eh, let's do it. We've gone this far, right? I was kind of wanting a couple different textures in there too. So that's why I was thinking that like, um, you know, at the plaza is, 
um, a metallic. We've got two glitters. And then with She's a Trooper, we will have um, a flat or a cream finish as well. gonna like kind of lay it there with the other colors to see if it yeah I think that goes all right we're gonna do it let's do it I like doing this off the nail because it makes it a lot easier to do because you can move the strip around in ways that you definitely cannot move your finger around to make it easy to see what you're doing and get things at the right angle. Okay, so now we're going to go back to the red. So you start out, you know, and put your different colors going across and then repeat. So this one will run right next to at the plaza. go. <laughs> this is a good thing I didn't want to save those bits, huh? Okay. Now it was coming in hot. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so we need another one of these. I'm probably only going to do one of the braids on video because we're already at 53 minutes um, and that's a pretty long video so in the interest of time I'm going to show you one and then I will uh, do the other one off camera and be able to see it in the nail fees at the end. Okay. I had too much crap on my desk. <laughs> and I literally just finished cleaning it because I moved everything around in the room that I'm in. This is like my dual purpose office because I have this desk and then I have the desk where I actually sit at when I'm working that has my computer and stuff um, and I moved my nail desk completely to a different direction and spot in the room um, so I cleaned everything when I did that like took everything off the desk and cleaned it up then sprayed it with cleaner and everything like Okay, so then we need one more. She's a trooper. Because I think we might have enough for it to go to the top of the... We might need to do one more, like, back and forth. But I don't think we need too much more. And I feel like it always looks like a hot mess while I'm building. 
but when it's done and it's on the finger, it's like just amazing. Yeah, we're gonna do one more. Let's do one more. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> and this one is too big for my finger, but I want it. I would rather it be too big than too small. So um, I'm going to have to do a little bit of cleanup on the nail too, but most of it will do before we put it on. We'll cut all around the edge to get any of these like wild bits that were left on the edges. I think it's I think it's gonna be really cute once we get it on it's gonna be like you'll see it be like oh okay because right now it probably looks a lot like a lot of craziness but I'm telling you once you get it on it's not I mean it is it's a pretty intricate design but it's not like it's not as crazy as it looks while you're building it. And this to me is definitely the easiest way to do it. Keep it off the nail, get the braid done and then put it on. But some people like to do it on the nail um, and that's fine. If it works for you, that's great, but I I just, I don't have the um, dexterity for that. <laughs> nope. All right, I need more at the plaza here. So we'll use this one that I had started the braid on. Stay, little booger. up with the because the edges of the post-it note keep sticking to my finger where it's sticky of course that's why I used the post-it note but it's annoying all right there was another green one here there it is all right I think this should be the last one for this one, I think we'll have enough to put it on your ring finger. This one needs to go parallel to coming in hot. Yeah, it 
this. Okay. All right, so we're gonna... I have my magnet thing for the um, magnetic glitter top coat on my, on my desk and <laughs> it keeps getting stuck to my scissors when I put them down. So I had to put it a little, a little farther away. All right, and then the other thing I think I'm gonna do is I'm going to cut off the white part for the most part here so that we just have a braid because I don't want the white part. All right, let's see how this looks. All right, where's our smusher? And then you wanna smush the heck out of this, get everything all like, nice and blended together and then we will take it off okay all right now let me clean up these edges here real quick so you guys can see how pretty it looks once it's all done and like on the finger. And then once I have plumping top coat over this, oh my goodness, it's going to be perfection. I don't like that you can see the white around the edges. That's annoying me. our braid. I think it turned out really good. What do you guys think? I think it's gorge. Okay, so there's our finished mani. Um, I hope you liked it and I hope you all have a fabulous Thanksgiving with your loved ones and I am thankful for you guys for sure. So um, I will see you on the next one. I love you guys. Bye.